it's Shelby. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my monthly favorites video and I am so excited. Actually this month I feel was kind of a longer month for me. I don't know. It might just be because I am so busy with school right now. Everything's like super crazy right now. Um. Also before we start the video I had two giveaways running that were cr that started in my last month's favorites video. One was for the the essential oils. So the winner of the essential oils is congratulations and then for the coloring book it's I don't know where it is right now but it's somewhere in my room but for the winner of the coloring book is so congratulations. I was just so excited to be able to do a giveaway. Thank you guys to everyone who entered the giveaway. It was super, super fun. I am going to be doing more giveaways really, really soon. Just make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll be notified when I upload videos and also when I do giveaways because I want to start doing more because I love them. Without further ado, let's just get into this favorites video. Also, as always, if you have ever have any questions or want to know anything more about these products that I'm mentioning or anything like that, everything will be in the description box as always. My first favorite, I feel like a lot of people are going to be putting these in their favorites videos just because they're so amazing. I don't think as of right now you can get it online but I do believe that you can get it in store still so of course it is the Too Faced Sweet Peach palette I was lucky enough to get one I don't know how I got so lucky but somehow I did and I got it and it is the most beautiful thing ever I'm wearing it on my eyeballs today and here's what it looks like you've probably seen this a couple times already if you guys want me to do a first impression on it or anything like that, let me know down below because I'm really interested in possibly doing one of those, but it's really hard to get, so I don't know if you want me to. So like I said, let me know down below if you would like me to do that. As far as more eyeshadow and also just my... Z palette in general. This is my first Z palette that I've ever gotten. I've been getting a lot of pan eyeshadows in my subscription boxes, so I was like, okay, this is telling you that you need to get a Z palette. And I just have a couple of things in here right now. Not too crazy. But yeah, I got this off Amazon and I love the color of it as well. I'm really, really excited to continue filling it up. Continuing with makeup. As far as bronzers, this is the one that I've been wearing a lot lately. I've been wearing my e.l.f. palette one because it's in my Project Pan. But I've also been wearing this one. And this is by Mellow and this is in the shade Bronze. And it just looks like that. I'm wearing it today. It's super, super pretty. Super buildable. I love the coverage on it. It gives me just enough color. So I really, really love it. And I've used it quite a bunch. And there's the pattern still on it. So that makes me really, really excited. Because it's not the biggest amount of pan. Yeah, really, really love that. Blush. I have been obsessed. I did... I got this in my the Sephora Paint It Pink like little value set and I did a first impressions video on that so if you want to check that out it'll be in the cards one is in blissful and I have been loving this I like how it's so small honestly just because it's really hard to get through products that are powder especially like blushes because you don't need that much you don't use that much so I've been loving this super super pretty peach color and if you want to see how, like I said, if you want to see how that looks on my skin, I used it in the first impressions video. Also, another thing that was in that video, this is the Becca Cosmetics Rose Gold Highlighter. That's what it looks like. Super, super pretty. I've been obsessed with Rose Gold lately, and I just, I love it. It gives me the perfect amount of highlight that I want, and that is also super, super um, buildable. You can use it super, super lightly or you can make it more dramatic, which is awesome. I've been loving the Maybelline Dream Velvet Foundation. This is in, I am in the shade 40. It is a little bit darker for me, but I like to 
be a little bit darker than I am, if that makes sense, because I am like pale as heck, like a ghost. So I love this because again, the buildability, um, I did find that it kind of like towards the end of the day, if I had it on all day, it kind of settled in places that I didn't want it to and it kind of started looking a little ew. To fix that, I just used a translucent powder and in my purse and I just touched it up. Super, super easy but I am obsessed with this. This is the NYX Matte Finish uh, Setting Spray. I am obsessed with this, you guys. Ever since I got this, I have not been reaching for any other finishing spray. I just love this so much. It makes me matte because I get kind of oily in my T-zone, so, and I'm dry everywhere else, so this is perfect because it hydrates my skin, and it makes me matte, which is super, super awesome. And it just, like, finishes everything, and it makes it look really, really good. I have a skincare product. This is by Valencia, and this is their Royal Rose Hydrating Serum. And, guys, this stuff is so good for my skin. My skin is super, super sensitive. It's just craziness. So, this stuff is amazing. It smells... It has a very, very light rose scent so it's not overwhelming it doesn't really stay on your face this stuff is so moisturizing i love it it does not feel silicone -y. it feels so soft and light on my skin i've been putting this on before i put on my makeup and i've been loving it and then also after i tone my skin at night I've been loving to put this on as well after the, after I cleanse my skin because it just feels so good and when I wake up in the morning, my skin just feels so hydrated. It has not broken me out either. Big, big, big win for that is a hand cream. I got this in my glossy box by the brand I love dot 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 and this is their mango and papaya scent. You guys, this stuff is amazing. I love it so much. You just need the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest little amount and it lasts so long and it makes your skin so moisturized, especially because I wash my hands a lot. My hands are super, super dry because of that, so I am obsessed with this and if you've been here for a while and you know me with fruity scents, it's like I'm obsessed with them, so this is definitely a huge win. I have a scent favorite this month. This is by Nouveau. And they have like a whole range of different scents. I did pay for them, but they did send me a coupon code. But I do not make any money off of them. I have like five of them and my boyfriend's birthday is coming up. I actually bought two for him as well. But this is so... Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this scent. This scent is the La Princess Perfume. And guys, like the perfect girly scent. It's a mixture of florally and sweetness. I'm obsessed, you guys. I just sprayed it more on me because it's so good. And I love the bottle. Look how pretty the bottle is. So pretty. So I'm super obsessed with it. And I think it's like a really good spring scent too just because it's so florally. I love this so much. I have two book favors this month, actually. The first one is an ebook, so I can't really like physically show you. It was a book that really shocked me, honestly. It's more like a book that I would think that my boyfriend would like but I didn't think that I would like it and it's called Moonlight. Don't remember the author's name off the top of my head but you guys I loved the book so much. I loved that it was an ebook too because most of the time I have my iPad or my phone with me when I have downtime in when I go to school or different places so I love that it was so on the go it's also free so that's pretty amazing too kind of like a sci-fi different type of book I don't want to reveal too much about it because I want you guys to go experience it for yourself I'm a super super girly girl so I did not think that I would like it but I definitely liked it definitely go and check that book out because it is Pretty darn cool, you guys. Fashion favorites, I have two this month. The first one is my Geneva watch, and this is a rose gold one. Too big on my wrist because I have a teeny tiny baby wrist. I had to get three links taken out of it. So it looks like that. 
I am obsessed with it. Like I said, I'm obsessed with Rose Gold. It's like perfect for me and I've been wearing this pretty much every day. I still haven't figured out what those little ones do, if they're for decoration or if they actually do anything. So it's actually kind of nice. My other favorite is actually what I'm wearing right now and they are called Sported Leggings and they are amazing, you guys. They are so comfortable. I am short. They, I had a feeling they were going to be a little bit long on me. So they kind of bunch up at the bottom, but pretty much all leggings do that to me. I love the material. It's super soft, but it's like the sporty kind of material that like absorbs your sweat and all that. If that, that might sound a little bit gross, but it's good for you. It's amazing. But the best part about these that I am so, so, so obsessed with, the waistband is a huge pocket. It is the coolest thing ever. If you're like me, I go to yoga, walk around my neighborhood, run around my neighborhood, even around my house, like today, I'm wearing them because when I'm doing dishes and stuff, I can't hold my phone and regular pockets don't really work. So you can put your cards in there, you can put money in there, which is so amazing because most of the time when I'm working out, I wear leggings and they don't have any pockets and it drives me nuts because then I'm like, where am I supposed to put my money and my phone? Drives me nuts solution the best solution ever so i am so 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 excited so if you want to check these out they are amazing i totally recommend getting some because they are the most comfortable things ever and they're a lifesaver with the best like invention ever in them and lastly as far as music i've just been loving kind of a little bit of everything right now honestly i kind of call my music style very bipolar because i just kind of like a little bit of everything and it changes with my mood and all that stuff i've kind of been obsessed with like um ariana grande and Beyonce's new album. I've also been obsessed with just country in general. Even though they haven't really come out with a lot of stuff lately. I'm obsessed with it anyway. Just Oh, Carrie Underwood came out with a new song called Church Bells. She is like perfect. I'm obsessed. So if you want to check out everything that I'm loving lately, I always am constantly adding music to my Spotify playlists. So they're always in the description box down below. And yeah, so those are all of my favorites for this month. I know I had a lot and I know this video is going to be really long. So thanks for hanging in there. You should hit that subscribe button. Also, if you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to let me know down below what you guys have been loving this month because I always am loving to hear what you guys are loving and sometimes they even try out the things that you guys have been loving. I hope that you guys are having an amazing, amazing day and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye guys!